It's another match day vlog and this time Steven Gerrard returns to Anfield but he returns as an opposition manager. Um, it'll be nice to see him back, he'll get a good reception. Um, he's really made Aston Villa quite a side. I think they were already a side before. Dean Smith, slightly unlucky to get sacked. Um, but they've got some really good players. Uh, they've got one of the best stadiums in the Premier League for me personally. Uh, so, yeah, it will not be an easy game. Um, sentiment goes out the window, just like Gerard said. For me, I want to absolutely batter this Aston Villa side. Um, and that's just because I want to win the league. Uh, no other reason, but I want to win the league. I want to get my goal difference up. Um, I just want to win in any way, but it would be nice to make a statement. It would be nice to beat them by a couple and obviously, hopefully go top of the table. Uh, Man City are against Wolves right now. Um, so let's see how that goes. But Redmen, just get the job done, please. Um, before we do get to Anfield, please do like and subscribe to the channel. Up the Reds. <laughs> Penalty shots, I think, 
two of them from the cop ends at least uh, looked quite um, dead set on pen but who knows I haven't seen the replays back um, and we'll all watch the day tonight hopefully with a win but yeah we just need to be more active we need to be better uh, we need to have a bit more movement and in and around the box we need to take our chances we need to shoot um, because we're getting a little corners but we're not even winning the others from them and we're going all the way back. We've had a couple of ch and chances, maybe half chances on the break, where our defenders just haven't communicated properly with our goalkeeper and we've kind of let them in a bit. But other than that, we've absolutely dominated and hopefully the pressure will tell in the second half. Come on, Reds.
I'm back home now and Liverpool did go on to win the game 1-0. Uh, a massive, massive win for the Reds. It feels so important, that win. Um, and I'd say those are the games that you've got to win to win the title. I know, very cliche, you've got to win a lot of games. Um, but a game in which it feels like a lot of things aren't going your way. Uh, the referees had a bit of an appalling game. Um, Aston Villa was very well drilled. Uh, and it felt like no matter what you did, you weren't breaking them down. You were getting the opportunities, but they weren't clear cut. And instead of getting frustrated, the Reds just carried on. Kept recycling the ball. And eventually, we get the breakthrough. Um, and, you know... It's a massive win. It feels massive. Uh, the other two teams around us did win, but it really doesn't matter because the Reds did their job. And as long as they continue to do their job, uh, then that's all we can ask for. Um, and we worry about the other games when they come along because we still have to play them. So someone's got to drop points somewhere. Um, as for the Reds, just a really dominant performance in that first half. Uh, several penalty shouts that weren't looked at. Uh, second half, the crowd got behind us even more. Um, it was electric atmosphere. Uh, it was very much we didn't care about who was on the touchline. That was a lot of the social media and the you know journalists getting into that. For us, it was all just about the three points. Um, yeah, it was nice to see Stephen Gerrard, but at the end of the day, uh, the badge he wore on his chest is the reason why everyone loved him at this football club. And the badge that our players wear now are much more important at the fact that we get those three points. Um, it is a good run of form for the Reds. Um, and we do play Newcastle uh, on Thursday. Um, Aston Villa fair play to them. Uh, well drilled, great shape. It was really hard to break them down. Um, they started to play with about 15 minutes to go. They did eventually come out. And they did actually cause us some problems. Liverpool lacked concentration with 15 minutes to go. Uh, and maybe if they would have came out throughout it, then, uh, you know, they could have got something more out of the game. But uh, I'm not really bothered. I'm just happy that Liverpool got the three points. Uh, and we move on to the next one on Thursday when we do play at home. Um, so there should be another vlog. Till then, do like and subscribe. Up the Reds.